top of the morning to YouTube. Shay and Zen here, bringing you going MLG episode 17. So we are taking the series in a slightly different direction. It was Domination we were planning to play, wasn't it? So, going to MLG, we did ask before for questions, didn't really get that much of a response. Now we're getting responses, so I thought, might as well start the series up again. So, we've got four people asking questions, so we'll try and get through it within one match. So, we'll start off with a really long one before the match starts, so I can read it. This one's from uh, Mortz. Well, uh, Mortz. <laughs> so, he's asking the same. He goes to an all boys private school, but across the road there's two girls schools. There's some pretty hot chicks who stand yeah, outside and talk to that, my mates. You know I only know them through Facebook, like yeah. we've added each other but never really talked. Meal. So he's asking you, if you were one of well, those you know, girls, kill, how would you like kill. a boy to approach you in a conversation? Really and since he's never yeah. talked to them, what subject should he bring up? Um they're coming out to me sweating you doing? buckets. It's not going to go very well. So, confident. At least have a topic. Hold on, hold on. You're really quiet. Did you tweak something? I didn't tweak anything. No? Okay. Wait, I don't know. Does this change yes. my voice? Yes. That changes my voice as well? Yeah, you're higher. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, so no, We're, We've kind of got some new technology on her side. And she's slightly technophobic. I'm not technophobic, it's just that I thought the volume button was for the speakers, not for their foot and microphone as well. Right, so carry on with your answer. Yep, confidence. If you have a topic, if you're on Facebook, you're going to know a little bit what, about what she likes anyway. Don't stalk her to the point where you know every little personal detail about what she's got up to the past weekend. That's just, no, that's wrong. So, confidence, and if you have confidence, you can't go wrong. So, confidence? So, topics, anything from Facebook, but don't mention it. Don't mention you know. No. Try and find some way to bring it up without... Find, like, a common interest. If there's something on Facebook you, you see that she likes as well. You don't want her thinking you're a stalker. No. But then he also said that his friends talk to him. So if he's near the friends while they're talking to the girls, he's... Yeah, gonna... ask them to introduce you or something. Exactly. Like, friends are supposed to be your main backbone for this sort of stuff. You need a wingman, or wingman. Wingman <coughs> actually work better than wing, wingman. I can't say yes, that fucking did. word. Yes, okay, did. so he was asking me, what would I say? I know what I would say. Don't you dare. Or just look at him oh. dead in the eye. Oh. Give her the eye, and just go, how you doing? That's yeah. how I talk to it. No, you can't Gets me you any girl I want. The only reason why that works for Joey is because he has confidence. I've dated Angelina Jolie with that line. Have you? That's no lie. <laughs> no, I would just... If anyone believes that. <laughs> <Wow>. <laughs> That's all i got to say. Wow. Uh, uh, confidence is the main thing. All women love confidence. Don't be cocky. Just know what you want. Know yourself. You yeah. Know yourself and you get really confused. You should never try and be somebody that you're not. So but humor never hurt anyone either. Like what you like, don't pretend to like something just for that. Shit. Oh. Yeah. What? So, should we get on to the next question? Yeah. If you do need any advice, Mort's... I'm not really that big on advice, but I can sort of give you personal experiences privately. Not that sort of privately, but... I can give, give advice. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Certain things we could talk about that could help. Anyway, next question from Spultz. What was your very first COD game? Mine was... Oh, shit, Mr. Clack. Mine was Modern Warfare 2, was it not? Yeah. I, uh, think, mine. I think it was... I played Modern Warfare 2 for a bit. And then it was Black COD Ops. 4 for a bit. And then Black oh. Ops was the main one I played. No, that's because that's the only one I had. Huh? That's the only one I had at that yeah. time. I, I hated Modern Warfare 2 with a passion. 
My first Black, Black Ops. No. <laughs> My first card game was Black Ops. Uh, that's because you and Joe mentioned it to me. I think Joe had mentioned it to you and you had mentioned it to me. Yeah. We, we just wanted a game that we could play together. That wasn't laggy or crappy or stuff because we yeah. were originally playing Metal Gear online. That game was a bitch. And we had so many people that were using internet glitches. Yeah. To win the game. So yeah, Black Ops. And the nice. lag switchers. I remember yeah. starting most of the matches and just dying from behind because of some dickhead Japanese wanker or something. <laughs> some of the Japanese that learn how to fuck games up. It's because they know to technology for some reason they can just like, get into the brain of technology. The only like, reason why they know technology is because usually they're the ones that make it. That's true. <laughs> That's a smart idea. How yeah. to annoy someone? <laughs> Be Japanese. <laughs> Annoyance level Asian. So, third and that question. that wasn't to be, like, racist or anything. Come on. Totally racist. I'm not. I hate all Irish guys. Wait. Yeah, too. Huh? Nothing. <laughs> Next question. I don't know how to pronounce this name, so I'm just going to say what I think it is. The Wiz. So, The Wiz. What is your favorite way of spending time with your girlfriend? Face down, ass up. That's the way I like to play COD on my own. In my bedroom. With the lights on. <laughs> With tissue. <laughs> Towels. Oh. Much less dirty. <laughs> TMI. <laughs> favorite time, or favorite way of spending time? I don't know. Playing games? It's all we ever do. Yeah, we do quite a lot. It just depends on what sort of like day, week, month, or if it's raining or hot outside. Yeah, yeah but Basically, we didn't take a lot. I picked a girl that... Oh, you wanker. I picked a girl that I see as my best friend, and I will give any man the same advice. If you can't see a woman as your best friend, she's not long-term material. She can't just get on with everything. No. It's like we have our differences, but... We have our similarities too. And it's not like one's overwhelming the other, is it? Yeah. There's a point where... There's a point with sex where you'll end up needing to put on some sort of friction cream and give up for the day. And after that, there's not really much certain couples can talk about. But we talk non-stop. Yeah. Especially you. Never girl. shut up. No, you. <laughs> you are the woman in this relationship. You never shut up. I wear the pants. Wait. Boxers. The hot pants? No, boxers. <laughs> <laughs> I've never worn makeup or a thong. Lies. <laughs> <laughs> it was such a funny memory. Uh, I'll never forget it. Yeah. I don't think anyone will. No, I don't think anybody will ever forget that imagery. Uh, anyway, next question. Next question. Ooh, Elite Gaming Nation. He's actually got three questions. Three? Uh, yep. Wow, amazing. But. Oh. I can't shoot these guys anymore. Okay, first question from Elite Gaming Nation. How did you start YouTube? I think I started YouTube because of Joe. One of my friends originally wanted to do YouTube, but didn't really carry it on. And I thought it would be a good idea, seeing as there's certain things I've done outside of school and university that made me really confident in speaking in front of crowds. So I thought I could carry it on and sort of get better at that. And I just enjoy entertaining people and make my ass of myself in front of others. So... Sure. Oh, no scope, you asshole! <laughs> Don't know where that came from. So let's move on. Second question. What is your favorite video game of all time? Hmm. We've talked about this before. I can't really put my finger on a specific game. You can. For genres, for certain genres, I can. But <laughs> for 
Don't laugh at me saying that word. Well, if you can pick on me and say stuff at me saying Paul, I can laugh at you because you can't say Sean. Okay. Yeah, it's only certain... If I had to pick a game, the game that I've always went back to from the age of seven and have been able to play, even though I know the story and the gameplay of it, would have to be Final Fantasy VII. Ooh. It's the only game that I can replay. Oh. So yeah, favorite game, Final Fantasy VII. What about you? Me? I honestly can't choose. I've tried and tried and tried, but I can't. The first game I ever played that I really, really got into, I really liked the series of was Resident Evil, obviously. Yeah. And then I got into like Metal Gear because of family, and then I I really like Tomb Raider because it's just a kick-ass chick. <laughs> but no, I can't choose. It's got to be somewhere between those three games because they're just awesome. Mm. They're awesome to me. You can do so much on them, and you can do different varieties of things. So I like that. There's Except for the new series, stuff. That's a problem. I don't like the new stuff they're coming out. Of the no, no. They really... Go back to your old ways. Yeah, they're doing action horror now, and not survival horror. But the best part was being stuck in a puzzle for like six hours. Yeah. Although I did like the remakes. The remakes. Well, yeah, the remakes didn't change them that much. See, I would love to see what a remake of Final Fantasy VII would be like, but they would have to keep it the same. Right, because we're running out of time here. Whoa. Third question, final question. Oh. What are your future plans in the COD community? Oh, without getting shot. To make one? Yes, I think the community is going down the shithole. The COD community, anyway, on YouTube. Oh, and I really just want to get a big group of us that can play together, that can criticize each other without being dicks about it, and just enjoy each other's videos. There doesn't need to be one big guy that runs it all, just a series of good channels, good communication, tell each other the truth and help each other out when they need it. That's really what my plans are for the community. And I can't... I've tried to do it since I've set up my YouTube channel, and it's hard to do that without getting something in return. If I send you messages and I send you videos, I'd like to be able to get a response back, to get some criticism, to get some... just <clears throat> gratitude. It, it yeah. makes my day going on the YouTube and getting a message from somebody going, yeah, your guide for Final Fantasy was brilliant. I've had so many of them and it's just made my day. And then you get a couple from COD and they're like, oh, your videos are really funny. That's good. Only problem is for the COD videos, I've had the same amount of negative comments and messages. That's what annoys me about the community and I want to change that. So if you feel the same way, please, by all means, message me because something needs done about it. You got anything to say? Well, yeah, it's like I've noticed that the community kind of sucks in all general ways because I've basically said I'll go out there and do, I'll go out my way to help people and I've had hardly any response mm. to it. There's not very many people that <clears throat> give you stuff on or give you... It's it's not like I'm looking for, to get something from it. I honestly generally want to generally... Yeah, but you'd like to have some sort of response for what you're doing. I would just like someone to go, yeah, could you do this for me? Or mm. could you find this for me? Or could you do that for me? Could you upload this? Yeah. You know? Could you find a competition for me? I, I'd love to do that. Right. If someone said that, it would be my day. We'll leave it at that. But I will give a quick mention. I'm going to be organising a tournament for the end of months just to try and get a community together. And also the fact that I was involved in another tournament... But I'll get to that in a different video, so please keep a lookout for that. Uh, if you want to send me questions for the next MLG episode, send me a PM with MLG as the title and then your question in the message, and you could be on the next video. Check the description for everybody's channels that have asked me a question in this one. Hope you guys enjoy, and we shall see you guys later.